Well, hello! Hi, it's me, Mr. Gibbs, here, chilling with my good old pal- Oh, okay, uh, a Skeletron here. Give me the old, uh, toss around here. It's fun. We're- we're having fun here. Well, oh, oh god. Oh, Jesus. Ow! Ow! Am I dead? I'm dead. Damn it. <laughs> Skeletron, you've gone way too far this time. Oh, does he disappear? Oh, he just goes away when he's murdered me. That's great. Today, we're gonna be messing around with some more of the Terraria mods, but this time, we're gonna be doing a base challenge. That's right, I'm gonna build a base against the infamous Skeletron. I don't know how it's gonna go, because he can kinda just fly around everywhere, and he goes through stuff, too. But, uh, we're gonna try and make it happen now. And I- I'm thinking I'm gonna have to go with, a with a floating base. You know, a flying base? What- I don't know. Is that a good idea? Or would it just kinda spin out of control? Only one way to find out, really. I think I'm gonna try and start, like, small? Like, kind of, like, a- a, a tiny little baby base? I think he leaves his arms behind. I'm seeing this now. I think he leaves his arms up there when he- when he- he leaves. He just goes off. He leaves them here. So he doesn't accidentally smack his family or something like that. He's got those crazy arms. Maybe he just leaves them here just in case there's no domestic abuse or anything. And when he needs to smack someone, he just comes back and he just grabs them. He's like, alright, I'll just get my arm. Look, hold on, hold on while I go grab my arms. It could be more of a trap to put ourselves in here. But, uh, I mean, we get a couch in here, maybe a TV. This place could be cozy. So right there, I'm gonna weld you on down here. Just weld that couch on down there. Look at that. Perfect. Okay. We got sitting room. You know, this is gonna be a nice little place. A desk to get get some get some work done here. We can even, you know what, we can even pop on in. Pop on in a little uh, a little work chair here. Look at that. Boom. Boom. Oh yeah. Oh, it's cozy. It's a cozy little house now. Um, it doesn't need a it doesn't need a wall there. Oh, I should have. Well, that's a problem. Okay, so it's gonna be kind of convoluted to get around this house. That's fine. The key is to just weld everything to the ground. That's the key. You know, I, I really think this is gonna work out well in the end. Do I have a- do I have a TV in here? Do, uh... I'm just, try, I'm just trying to make this place just feel like home, you know? That's a microwave? I don't know. Uh, is that a- that's a monitor? I guess a monitor will do? Or is this a TV? It also looks like a microwave, but I'm gonna say that one's a TV. Alright, and I'll put the, uh, decaying skull of my enemy right there. Uh, just go ahead and put- put- put that on there. And also the decaying skull of my mother and father. Um, right here. Boom. <laughs> We're not doing that. And, uh, I'll put my, uh, grandmother's ashes right here. Uh, I kinda had to stuff her into a, ch a Chinese- <laughs> I, I got takeout and then I spilled my grandmother's ashes so I kind of just, you know, transferred them into it. Looking pretty, pretty, pretty homey in here. I think we just need a friend. We need a friend that we can hang out with so it doesn't get lonely. Per perfect. Hold on. Mr. Torso Man. Here we go. Uh, there we go. He's, uh, he's a riot at parties. There he is. Oh, this is a per this is a perfect little place. Oh, we also need guns on it, don't we? That's a key part of the base. I completely forgot about that. Okay, hold on. We need to... Uh, let's go ahead and put on some hover balls here. Where are my hover balls? Oh, yeah! Look at that! Oh, it's it's home, except it flies. There you go, ladies and gentlemen, the future. Welcome to it. Okay, so uh, wh what else do we need in here? Oh, we're gonna need a toilet, obviously. Um, right next to the couch and my decaying carcass. Yes! Where else? It's It's kind of getting a little shaky in here. Um, I just think that's because everything's welded down, but it's fine. Now, the question I have to ask myself is, are these turrets going to be able to- Can I weld them on here and they'll just work fine? I don't know. Um, I'm guessing- I'm gonna go with a solid maybe. Yeah, definitely maybe. Um, can- is it- Oh, did it really still get stuck in the ground? Are you serious? Really? How- God damn it, they just get wedged in the goddamn ground. It's kind of- it's kind of be like, uh, kind of like a zeppelin, you know? It's just- oh, uh-oh, I sh really should have locked it down here. Um, except it's gonna be like a zeppelin, except not full of hot air. And, uh, you know how zeppelins? Just a really bad idea. Um, you know, they really- there's a reason why they don't use them anymore, and that's because they just fucking explode. And I don't know why you would use something like that in war, like, why would you be like, hey, can we fly around this giant balloon filled with, you know, flammable air, fucking just ox- pump full of oxygen. It was clearly a bad idea. I don't know why they didn't see that coming. Maybe, you know, my- my war strategy is a little flawed, 
but I just think it was uh, poorly conceived. Okay, is that strong enough? Oh yeah, it is, plenty. Okay, so now that's beautiful, and uh, let's go ahead and put down a little test guy to see if these guns shooting are going to, you know, uh, tip it over, because I think that's a, a really good chance of that, now that I'm thinking about it. So can we get a bad guy? Just a downright no good, no good dude. Um, what do we have in here? Oh boy, I got the alien monster, classic, bad guy, Teddy. Um, not evil enough though, where, where, where? Dinosaurs, evil helicopter, good, good to go with that one. Uh, let, oh, okay, here we go. Oh, they're shooting them, yep, they got him. Oh, wow. Oops, what did I just undo? Oh, uh, I guess I just undid him. Okay, they absolutely annihilate them. Wow, wow, oh my god. This, oh, wait, this one's almost busted. I've never seen that happen before. They can break? Oh, god damn it. Oh, that's not good. I don't really know how to... I'm gonna have to replace this. The Skeletron guy is probably pretty strong, you know, arguably. The strong, pretty strong individual. Uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna put down one of these as well. I'm just gonna put it on in the middle. It's just the zappy thing, it just zaps everything. I feel like it's a good one to have around. Just one of those, those, one of those things that just zaps everything. Okay, and that should even out. Yes, look at it, it's just like a little ship of death. That is death in, but inside though, very cozy. Boom, boom, and now we're perfect. But this is kind of a bad view for things. Not really, not really what we're, can I zoom? Maybe I can, I can't, oh, I can, oh yeah, I can zoom out enough from here. Perfect, kind of, oh, I, and I can get like, kind of like a, you know, uh, I don't know, some kind of Star Trek Captain Kirk view here. And I can just go right on out. This is perfect. This actually ended up being, you know, a lot smarter than I thought it was gonna be. I thought this was just gonna be a mess, but I'm actually really happy with this base here. I'm not gonna lie, I'm proud of this. I was like, oh, we'll start off with the flying base, and it's probably gonna go horribly wrong, and then we'll make another one, but I'm, I'm pretty sure I nailed it, you know? Arguably, uh, I, this is the best base that has ever been conceived. Okay, here we go, yep, get him! Get him! Oh yeah, here we go, okay, he can actually hurt me, that's a bad thing. Uh, I don't know if he can hurt my- th oh, he's- he's just going nose to nose with it! He doesn't even know what to do! He- ow! Ow! I'm getting- ow! Okay, I was murdered? That's cool. Skeletron is gone. Great. So, right, he goes away once I've died. That's a bad thing. And by fix that, I mean I'm gonna drink a ton of apple juice, baby. Just a bunch of apple juice. Just to fill me on right on- right on up there. It is- it's fall, it's the season, you gotta drink- you gotta drink some apple juice. Drink some apple cider. That's what I'm saying. Here we go. Boom. Just fill up on that. 700. Is this cheating? I don't know. I'm just kind of just like a wall of thorns pretty much, except instead of thorns, they all shoot bullets. You know what I'm saying? Um, we'll go ahead and put, uh, put a bunch of them on top here. Okay, boom. Because it does seem to be that he is always just, uh, he, he's just itching his little nosy on the top here. on my little guy. Uh, he's just getting a nice little static shock from here. So I'm just gonna, just a bunch of guns, baby. If that doesn't kill him, I, uh, I don't think anything, oh no. Oh, we've done it. Oh no. Uh-oh. Okay, this might be bad. I, I can, actually, I can, oh, but I, I can't hold it, because my same button for the turrets is the button for my, oh boy, for these. I really screwed up, guys. Hold on. Okay, perfect. Now we take Skeletron, we put him over here. The Skeletron, uh, there you go. Get over there, boy. Okay, he's gonna come up in here really quick. Oh, okay, here we go. And seven, there we go. <laughs> oh, this better work. Oh my goodness, this better work. That is a lot of, that is just a lot of shooting going on. Hold on, oh, where'd he go? I killed him. <laughs> it was actually really easy, yeah. So, oh, but he destroyed one of my guys. Well. You know, now I'm thinking about it, I, uh, think that my really, my, my impor most important thing on here is the million guns that I put on it. Yeah, that's probably it. There's also these dungeon guardians. Um, if you've played the game, they kill you instantly. Let's go ahead and give them a, just give them a whirl. <laughs> okay, here we go. Oh, get, oh, there we go. Okay, and hit seven. Here we go. Here they come. <laughs> just the whirling <laughs> wall of heads. <laughs> Let's do this. I'm not scared! You guys are actually really, really slow. I'm gonna stop wasting my ammo here. Skeleton, centipedes, 
Oh, okay, here we- Oh, wow, they're killing me fast. I can't even see. I'm dead. I'm super dead. Wow, that killed fast. Oh, oh, and they all left. That's- Oh, no, they- Where the- How did I just die? Hello? Oh, they're coming- Wait, oh, there they are! What the hell? Did they just come out of nowhere? Okay, so those guys are unkillable, making it not fair. Definitely cheaters. Definitely, uh, definitely cheating. So I'm gonna take that out there. Now we're a little- we're a little lopsided now. There's nothing wrong with that. Uh, you know, we're just getting it aimed up towards the sky a little bit. And now, what we're gonna do is, uh, for the final run, you know, why don't we throw down some other bosses as well? Okay, that's a lot. That's a lot. I- Oh boy, oh, can I get in my- Let me get in my battleship! Let me- Ah! No! Let me get in! Let me- Ah! <laughs> Alright, we'll take this. I can still shoot my guns. I'm- I'm still here. Hey, come back. I'm still here. I ain't done with you yet. Okay, here we go. Now we're talking. Now we're- Oh, here we go. Don't kill me. Oh, wow. Okay. No, oh, wait, did I kill one of them? I totally killed one of them. Oh, now I'm dead. Okay, well, I also killed them. So, you know, that was kind of like, uh, I don't know, pretty good. I will call that even? Can we call that even? Well, I think this has been a successful day. Look, my grandmother's ashes didn't even spill. How- how- how's that for, uh, for a bit of serendipity there? You- you know, you fight every single boss on the planet, and, uh, your- your grandmother's ashes are still right side up in a- in a, uh, a Panda Express box. That's wonderful. Just good. Just good. <laughs> you know, I think I'm gonna live here. This is a cozy little place, especially when you do it like this. You can zoom out, and you can see the world around you, but, uh, you know, who- who cares? You can just zoom in on in here, and you got your own personal space. That's- that's just nice. I hope you all did enjoy a little bit more of the, uh, bases versus boss type video. Uh, I want to do some more of them still. I like finding new bosses and these Terraria ones have been really good, but if you guys know any other bosses you want me to try and make a base and defend against, let me know. Um, I'll try and use less turrets next time because, arguably, it's- it- it makes it easy. Anyways guys, I hope you did enjoy. If you did, don't forget to leave a like, and of course I will see you all in the next video. Have a fantastic day and a fantastic life. Goodbye! <laughs>